This is Nairobi Dam in Kibera that was built in 1952 to supply potable water to Nairobi. In the background is the vast plain overlooking Ngong Hills, which is the major source of water. River Ngong cascades down the hills to the dam before it joins the Athi River system. Past tens of thousands of wildlife roamed the plains freely and drank water from the river together with the Maasai cows that there was barely any settlements in the background. The water from Nairobi Dam was part of the potable water supply for the city long before the sailing club was established. Today, the dam is a pale shadow of itself. It has been invaded by water hyacinths that had been, had been introduced by colonial farmers to cleanse water ponds. It now become part of the sewage system, the Nairobi River system. From filth in settlements along the river and the numerous settlements wash into the river. There has been numerous construction of high-rise buildings in the wetlands of the dam. Some politicians, as usual, in their antics, have suggested that the dam should be drained. That is a selfish outburst. I suggest that the dam should be dredged and cleaned. That is why Nairobi River Commission was actually formed.